Now the police every move you make the studio recording CD box is um, the super deluxe edition best value box set of 2019. You can pick this up for as little as £15 on Amazon, maybe even less in your local supermarket in the UK. And it contains all five albums and a bonus uh, disc called Flexible Strategies. And this is a repeat of the vinyl box that came out in 2018, so it took them a year to reproduce this as a CD box set for some unknown reason. But I was quite surprised at the packaging when I got one of these because it's just much better than you'd expect. And with proper lift off lid, um, rigid board box, bit of detail in the inner box lid, which you might not expect for this kind of price point. You even get a little ribbon here to access all the CDs, which again is not something you'd necessarily expect at this price point. And then all the CDs themselves, there's some more detail there inside the box. All the CDs themselves are, are, are kind of gatefold, they're quite nice. They're not, you know, absolute budget kind of simple card sleeves with nothing else. You do get a little gatefold. I mean, the discs themselves still slide out like that with no additional protection, but you know, you are getting six CDs for. 15 quid. Now these contain the new remasters which sound excellent so it's it's kind of a no-brainer I mean there's no bonus tracks on the on the actual albums but you do get the flexible strategies bonus disc and as I say it's you know for, for the price point it's these aren't proper vinyl replicas but they're still decent um, bit of effort's been made some a and m label replication going on on the cd i mean the police are long overdue some proper super deluxe editions on their albums uh, whether we're going to see that anytime soon remains to be seen ghost in the machine darkness the last track on this record was used to great effect on the uh, Netflix Mind Hunter series. I don't know if anyone saw that, but that's a that was a that's a great track. And then of course, Synchronicity is the last album. This doesn't have Murder by Numbers on it, as the original CD did have, because they've put that on the bonus disc, which you'll see in a second. So here is Flexible Strategies. And you get the same 12 bonus tracks as on the vinyl version. And that's this is the one criticism with this box set. There's so much more space on a CD. A, a vinyl record is generally limited to, you know, 45 to 50 minutes maximum. So you get 80 minutes on a CD. So there's half an hour of extra space. That could be another six or seven tracks. So there's no real need other than just laziness to maintain the vinyl. I mean, when you think about when CDs first came out, they, they, the record companies put bonus tracks on them, didn't they? They put bonus remixes, bonus tracks to encourage people to buy them. So they weren't worried about maintaining consistency between vinyl and CDs at that time. So why are they worrying about it now? You know, they're choosing to make out that it's really important to be consistent when it's it's not you know why not make the most of the format so that's a bit disappointing there's plenty of extra stuff that could have gone on here but any criticism is really just a minor quibble because all five albums and a bonus disc for 15 pounds is pretty incredible and the box that it comes in is really nice so even if you own message in a box which i do you know, it's impossible not to resist the lure of every move you make the studio recordings no reason not to get this new remastering bonus tracks on that extra disc but while we're looking at this i thought you might be interested so as i said these aren't proper japanese style vinyl replica but if you're willing to pay more and a lot more actually 
uh, they are available so let me just show you a box from 2007 so this is a Japanese box set I mean the box is actually made at Disc Union it's a special promo box but as you can see it's very glossy and contains all five albums but it doesn't contain the bonus disc ob obviously from this year's and last year's box set because that's a recent thing but it does contain all five albums and they're all in proper vinyl replica presentation so here's the first record and they've all got Japanese style OB strips as you would imagine they all come in these resealable outer sleeves and I mean I have to say some of these wouldn't have had inner sleeves in the first place so you're probably not missing that much with the new version but that's the replicating the original vinyl sleeve no inner sleeve but you do get lyrics in English and Japanese second album again Obi strip you can see this was done for the 30th anniversary 2007 so 1977 so that ties in again proper reproduction of the original no inner sleeve lyrics in english and japanese third album this time you do get an inner sleeve there's the disc and this is replicating the inner sleeve on the third album if we go back to the cd from the 2019 box set you can see that, that in that gatefold that's what they've done they've replicated the inner sleeve because this is the inner sleeve here so you're not really missing out on that much i guess but yeah, so inner sleeve, same thing again. Little booklet with lyrics in English and Japanese. Ghost in the machine. I mean, there's some spot varnish going on here, which is quite nicely done. Inner sleeve replicated. And that's what the CD looks like. Obviously, because these are Japanese, they're all protected by these little inner sleeves. Same kind of booklet. Finally, synchronicity. Now, unlike the new CD, the new reissue, this one does have murder by numbers on it i mean it's a debatable point kate bush did this as well uh, with walk straight down the middle from the central world it, you know it was a bonus track on a cd and you know 20 30 years later the artists decide well it's not really part of the album and wish hadn't done that so they they move a cd bonus track back to a kind of uh, extra tracks disc and that's effectively what's happened the trouble is if you've grown up with listening to it on CD, you think that that's part of the album really, in your mind. There's the inner sleeve for synchronicity, quite a nice disc design and pretty high quality replication. So if you think the Japanese paper sleeve versions look better, then you would be right. But let's not forget these are eye-wateringly expensive, so each of these discs to buy import from Japan would have cost about £20. That's £100, and then there would have been a bit extra for the box. So I reckon this was, I can't remember, but I think this is about £125, which is very, very expensive. And when you consider you're getting the whole, you're getting this entire box for £15. This was £125, so it gives you a good indication of um, you know, what great value this is. And you, of course, you get the new remastering with this, which you don't get with this one, and you get the bonus. CD. So I don't really regret buying this, but wow, anyone that buys this new box set on CD, it's like the bargain of the century. I mean, it's ludicrously great value. So there you go. The vinyl box is over 100 quid. The CD box is 15 pounds. Go figure. But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this look at the best value box set of 2019. So this is Paul from Super Deluxe Edition taking a look at these two police box sets.